I have a Fantech VHR 1405R HRV unit controlled by a Fantech EcoTouch. Yesterday I removed the, the core and grills for cleaning and then put them back. Now I have a E01 code on the EcoTouch that won't go away. During the cleaning process I didn't unplug the unit I just removed the cover of the unit and removed the core. I've tried unplugging the unit and then plugging it back in after about a minute but the E01 code is still there. How do I fix this? HTTP colon slash www.eaglemount.com slash download slash shr underscore vhr underscore ins dot pdf http colon slash www.fantech.net slash documentation slash residential percent 20 systems slash 400608 percent 20 eco touch percent 20 installation percent 20 manual dot pdf notice warning on top of page one regarding working on the unit with the power connected. Try turning the power to the unit off for 10 seconds, then turn it back on and tell me how that worked, we can go from there without a time limit. Please do not forget to rate my work when we get it fixed. I unplugged the unit for 10 seconds and then plugged it back in. The E01 code is still present. I then unplugged it again, but this time for approximately 1 minute and then plugged it back in. The E01 code still hasn't gone away. I also remembered that this morning there was a power outage at my house for approximately 15 minutes. Not sure if the power outage would have this effect. Thanks, like the printed circuit board may have been damaged by the power spike that hit it during the power outage, or by working on the unit without turning power off to it. If you can send me two photos one of the printed circuit card so that I can see the entire card clearly, and one of the wiring diagram glued to the inside of the unit's electrical control panel, close up, well focused and from straight on. I can mark them up with further troubleshooting instructions, we can go from there. Here's A the photos you requested. I couldn't get a clearer pick of the circuit card without unplugging some wires. Hello again, coaching you troubleshooting that inaccessible mess of wire connections could take days, and still not end well. I am going to leave you with a statement that replacing the printed circuit board has a 70 to 80% chance of working, the rest is too compact and the diagram the manufacturer provided on the printed circuit board is too vague to allow reasonable troubleshooting of anything else. I will opt out, we can see if anyone else here has a better idea for you. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.